We all make mistakes while doing our makeup, but before you wipe off that face in frustration, this beauty episode of Anoki Daily Spotlight TV is just for you. I'm going to show you some solutions to those common beauty blunders. Our first beauty blender has to do with liquid liner. Now we all love our liner, but it is the quickest makeup trick that can go wrong by having your liner too jagged or uneven. So before you turn it into a big black blob or you wipe it off, let me tell you how to correct it. So you've taken the eyeliner a little too high, a little too jagged. Before you're quick to wipe off the eyeliner, here's a quick erase. All you have to do is take a flat pencil brush and a metallic eyeshadow and apply some of that metallic eyeshadow on top of the problem area. Beauty blender number two, mascara smudging. So you've done your makeup, it looks awesome, you're super happy and you go for your mascara and it smudges. So before you turn your eyes into raccoon eyes, here's a quick tip to erase that smudge. So if your mascara smudges under your eye, you can turn it into a quick, soft, smoky eye by using a pencil brush or a smudging brush and a soft brown eyeshadow and simply blending out that mascara with a little bit of that brown shadow. If your mascara smudges on the top of your eyelid, just use the same shadow brush you applied your shadows with and blend out that mascara. Alternatively, if you don't wear eyeshadow on the bottom or the top, just use concealer and blend out that mascara. Beauty blender number three is when your lipstick goes too far over your lip line or you just create a very uneven lip line. But there's a simple trick to correcting this one too. Now this blender is really evident when you're wearing bright colors or dark colors. So if you've gone too far with your lipstick, all you have to do is take a cleansing wipe, wrap it around your finger and take off the lipstick in the area which it's gone too far. Now once you've wiped it off, go back in with a little bit of concealer to blend in the foundation and start your lips again. Beauty blender number four is when we find our foundation is too heavy or too matte. Now, us South Asian ladies may be guilty of this when we are decked out in our Indian outfits and we go outside only to realize how we actually look, but there is a quick fix for this. All you have to do is take a wet napkin and pat it over your face. Alternatively, you can also use a moisturizing spray like the Max Fix Plus and just spray it all over your face and then pat it with a dry napkin to absorb the excess makeup. So the last beauty blender is too much blush. You do your makeup, you've done your contouring, you've done your highlighting, and in one mirror it looks great, only to catch yourself in another mirror and it looks streaky or it looks too heavy. Now there's a quick fix for that too. So how do you correct blush or contouring gone wrong? There's two ways you can do this. One, you can just take a powder brush and your powder and simply powder over that area, blending it out softly. Alternatively, if it's very dramatic and very harsh, you can use a stippling brush and a little bit of your foundation and blend out the affected areas of your blush. I bet you didn't think it was that easy. For more on our show, visit us at anokimedia.com or our YouTube channel, and don't forget to interact with us on Facebook and Twitter.